What is up guys? Alex from Iron Fit again. Today is back and biceps and starting off with a basic movement, pull-ups. Um, if you guys look at the way I'm doing it, I don't uh, focus on just getting the chin over the bar. I kind of have my chest up as I'm doing it. If you guys haven't tried that, try it. It engages the lat um, a lot more. Uh, than just a regular pull-up that you, when you're just trying to reach over, have to reach over the chin over the bar, I mean. Um, starting off, I went four sets of eight to ten. Um, just focus on eight, and if you can go more, go more. Uh, breaks that are about four to five seconds, and between sets, I'll let your body recover a little bit, but just starting off with this basic movement uh, really engages the lat and... Uh, your secondary bicep muscles as well. Um, moving on um, to a seated row. This movement is also a pretty basic movement. Uh, everybody has a machine like this at the gym, but starting off, <clears throat> I think with 120, 140 pounds. Um, also, four sets. This was a pretty light session, but again, four sets. Uh, aiming about 12 to 15 the first couple sets and then just upping the weight and then after I raise the weight going for about 10 repetitions that's where I'm usually aiming at and here you guys could um, see that I'm kind of rocking a little bit which is uh, I guess which is fine because I have a pretty good mind muscle connection with my lats uh, at, for a beginner, I wouldn't recommend rocking too much. Um, for for those of, uh, of us who've been lifting for um, a period of time, we uh, have a mind muscle connection where um, I'm not saying we should do a uh, shitty form, but um, one, you can feel the muscle and uh, it's easier even if the form isn't all that perfect. You know. Circle so I small, keep a certain few. Only ever us, just the perfect crew. People ask for help, can we work with you? Got me on the verge of rude. If I may ask you kindly, please fuck off, I got work to do. Moving on, every day improving on. Came a long ways, they're like, damn, G, you're stupid on. Something must be in the water, let us know what you be on. Studying my moves. So for this one, pretend like your uh, hands are kind of like hooks. Uh, a lot of people, they tend to uh, pull with their hands, and what that does is uh, uh, isolates the bicep a little bit. That's not really what you want. You want this to be a uh, lat movement, uh, not a bicep exercise. Here again, uh, moving to uh, standing cable rows. It's a uh, pretty good exercise that I recently started incorporating it in my routine. Um, just grabbing cable, uh, the cable handles and just putting both of them on one clip and uh, doing this movement. Um, I kind of got the idea from the online coach. If you guys uh, watch his uh, YouTube videos or anything or follow him on Instagram, awesome guy. Um, there's a lot of really cool uh, tips about just uh, lifting life or just life in general if you're about that um, but go ahead check his channel out as well uh, super inspiration kind of reminds me of uh, Christian Guzman a little bit but uh, he has his own little philosophy a little bit different but uh, definitely a guy worth watching And here we're just going bent over rows uh, with the barbell. Not going super heavy, uh, just working on my muscle connections, uh, having the reps a little bit up there. Uh, so a little bit more of a hypertrophy work on this on this workout. <clears throat> it's good to change it up. I personally think it's good to change it up from um, strength to hypertrophy. That's usually how I do it. Alright guys, so here finishing off with a basic movement, the biceps. I uh, went for about six sets on this one. Um, a warm-up set, and then I think I don't think I went any higher than 30s. Uh, that way, just uh, keeping the mind-muscle connection, uh, 
uh, constant tension on the muscle and as as people think this is a really easy exercise to do a lot of people um, rock a lot they uh, don't feel their uh, the mind muscle connection with their bicep band. The best way uh, that I think to get that mind muscle connection is to do it slowly, with even if it takes going lighter weight. A lot of people just want to go through the motion, take it down a notch, and uh, go a little lighter, but a little more reps. That way, you can actually feel the muscle. All right, that one. A few exercises that I uh, didn't get the time to record uh, were. Seated uh, machine press for the bicep, very basic. A uh, few movements for the back, uh, which was just a uh, lat pull down, some more rows, uh, more isolated movements. <laughs> I, 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 I'm in love with this life, there's no stopping, no option. I'm so high, y'all ask Mary Poppins was popping from city to city. I, I, I touch down and drop in, I'm selling like hotcakes, you fuckers are flopping. Nice. Right. Set two, three to go. Remember, guys, the pump was just an illusion. And here you can make fun of my right, guys, ending clip. Uh, I struggled a lot on this one, but thanks for <laughs> watching, guys. All right, that was it for the back and bicep exercise. <laughs> that was it for the. All right, guys, thanks for watching. That was your bicep and back. All right, guys, that was it for back and biceps for today. Thank you all for watching. See you guys in the next one. I'm out.